Whether you've driven or been a passenger in a car, you've stopped at a stop sign. It's an internationally recognized symbol and one of the most important traffic devices for road safety today. But you've probably given little thought to why these signs are red and why they're in the shape of an octagon. Red is universally used as a color to represent a warning, traffic signals, fire alarms, danger and prohibit signs, and siren lights for emergency vehicles have all adopted the color red. Psychologically, red has been used for centuries to symbolize danger because it's the color of blood. However, there's more of a scientific reason behind why stop signs are red. If you look at the visible light spectrum of the human eye, red has the highest wavelength, thus it is the least affected by air particles. Essentially what this means is that red is the easiest color to see from a distance in conditions like fog, rain, and snow. Because of this, when the stop sign was standardized in the 1920s, it seemed only natural that red would be the color of choice. Although, it wasn't until 1954 that the stop sign became the bright red color that we know today. Before that, stop signs were actually yellow. Red was the first color of choice, however, at that time, there was no red dye in existence that wouldn't fade over time. So yellow it became, and remained, for over 30 years, until 1954, when manufacturers finally developed a fade-resistant sign that red became the stop sign's permanent color. As for its eight-sided shape, that was adopted fairly early on when the sign was standardized in the early 1920s. The octagon is a unique, easily recognizable shape that all drivers can identify regardless if it's day or night, or if they're facing the front of the sign or facing the backside. That instant recognition is key to preventing confusion as to which driver has the right of way at an intersection. So the next time you pump the brakes at this red octagonal sign, remember, a lot of careful consideration went into making it exactly the way it looks. Thanks for watching. You never know what topic I'm going to cover next, so please subscribe and give me a reason to keep making these videos.